Okay, pet lovers, are Haitian immigrants eating dogs and cats here in the United States? Like in this little photo right here. These dogs are on the back of a bike going to a food mart where they do eat uh, animals, cats and dogs. But uh, are, are immigrants doing it here in the U.S.? Well, apparently there's controversy about that. I, I don't know what it is. But what I wanted to know is, do they eat cats and dogs in Haiti? And I really couldn't find anything about that for some reason. It didn't come up. But I did find places where they do eat uh, cats and dogs. Like the title at the top here says, Nine Countries That Eat Cats and Dogs. Let's take a look at them. Countries That Eat Cats and Dogs. All right. China is a big one. Now, we remember that from the Wuhan wet market, you know, back when the bug, you know, was uh, going around a few years ago. Apparently, Taiwan, although I think they recently might have outlawed that. Apparently, some places in Hawaii. Excuse me for a minute. Okay, let's get to the chart here. I don't know if this is going to come up well, but it's amazing of the countries that do allow the consumption of dogs and cats. Now, you'll be surprised, perhaps. But uh, let's see. Australia. It's illegal to slaughter and sell, but it's okay for the consumption in most parts. Brazil, consumption's okay. Canada, the slaughter and sale of cats and dogs and the consumption is okay. Can you believe it? Our uh, neighbors up north. Well, I guess we have to keep an eye on them if they come to the U.S., right? Uh, Chile, Colombia is illegal. China, yeah, here's the big one, as I mentioned at the top. Slaughter is legal. Consumption is legal, except for maybe in some provinces. I think China is trying to put a halt on that because of public outlying opinion. Uh, France, France. Slaughter and sale are illegal, but consumption is legal. Same with Germany. India, the sale is legal and consumption is legal. In some parts of India, at least. Hong Kong is completely illegal to sell and eat animals like that. Kazakhstan? Well, it was legal to eat pets, you know, dogs and cats, but it's going to be outlawed, apparently. It was in 2021. The Philippines? Well, that is kind of a iffy one there. Russia? Apparently, consumption is legal. Well, Taiwan, our good ally there, in the, right next to China, they outlawed the sale of uh, the meat in 1998 and consumption since 2017. So, relatively recently. The United Kingdom! <laughs> Sales are illegal, but consumption is legal. I guess you can eat your own dog and cat. But then I guess slaughter and sale in the U.S. is illegal. You can't sell, a, you know, dog and cat meat. But I have a feeling that eating your own pet in the U.S. is okay. I have a feeling Let's see. I saw there's some African countries, Canada, United States. So let's see what this. Let's see. In December 2018, Donald Trump signed the Dog and Cat Meat Trade Prohibition Act. Oh my God. He's President Trump was the one who signed it. The act against eating dogs and cats. Previously, dog and cat meat was legal in 44 states. Hey, check that out. 
Donald Trump outlawed the eating of cats and dogs in the U.S. Now, that's not getting enough news right there. Come on. But there's all kinds of countries where you eat, uh, you can't eat uh, animal, you know, dog and cat meat. I know Switzerland was up there. I just don't see it right here on my list right now. South Korea and stuff. But uh, let's see, cat meat. Mainland China, Japan, India, South Korea, Malaysia, Taiwan, Vietnam. Vietnam's a big one. Remember when the Vietnam boat people came over here after the Vietnam War decades ago? I think there were similar allegations that they were eating dogs and cats. And, you know, there probably was some truth to that. Belgium, Denmark, Italy. Some of this is during wars, you know, when it's extreme. All right, in Switzerland, the sale is outlawed, but you're okay to eat your own dog and cat. Well, okay, so that's just what I wanted to look into, to see, uh, do they eat dogs and cats in Haiti, even if they're not doing it here in the U.S.? Can they do it over there? I'm going to guess yes, since you can do it in so many European countries. It's legal, you know, to at least eat it. So, you know, why wouldn't they if they're poor? But uh, I, I, are they going to be one of the few countries, this island nation out in the Caribbean or wherever it is, that are not eating dogs and cats? But the big thing I just stumbled upon during this video, I didn't even see it before, was the part where Donald Trump was the one who uh, signed the laws outlining that. Dang, I've got to find that again and maybe focus on that if I, if I can. Oh, the United States. Right here. Ah, oh, come on. In December 2018, Donald J. Trump signed the Dog and Cat Meat Trade Prohibition Act of 2018 into law. Previously, the dog and cat meat trade was legal in 44 states. So it was Trump who outlawed it. Well, that's my big revelation during the course of this recording. And it's not going to be professionally edited. I'm just going to stop the recording and throw this up, okay? <laughs> I'm more of a, I, I tend to want to be a live streamer where what you see is what you get. But uh, I'm doing it on OBS right now. So let me throw this up, see if I can make some kind of a thumbnail and uh, really tout uh, Trump's horn here a bit later.